We use SmartFit quite a bit in the end of our rehab program. We're really trying to get movement behavior to become more automatic. My name is Dr. Chris Powers. I'm the owner of the Movement Performance Institute. Our specialty is really training corrective movement mechanics in athletes. And uh, our specialty centers on trying to identify causes of lower extremity injury. And based on that information, we've designed intervention programs and training programs to correct faulty mechanics. As part of our goal to correct movement, a real important part of this is to train movement behavior such that it becomes more automatic. In, in other words, the, the athlete doesn't have to think about the movement corrections. Um, and one way we can accomplish this is through dual tasking. We use SmartFit to largely provide a dual tasking paradigm by which athletes are moving, and we're using the pods to do this. The actual games take their mind off the actual movement mechanics and, and direct the attention elsewhere. Our thought here is that by implementing dual task training, we're helping facilitate better motor learning with the idea that that would likely carry over more readily to the athletic field. We use SmartFit quite a bit in the end of our rehab program where we're really trying to get movement behavior to become more automatic. We find the pods very helpful in that respect. The app has really progressed to be very user-friendly. It captures all the data in a readily readable format. Uh, it's easy to use, and it really provides a versatility of use for the, the smartphone system. You know, in the past, we rely heavily on, on feedback to train corrective movement patterns. Uh, but what, we, what we've really been missing is really making this movement more automatic and, and really practicing the correct movements while the patient is thinking about something else. Because in the athletic world, they're not focusing on how they're moving. They're focusing on other players, the ball, et cetera. I think this is a very important step in terms of translating what we do in physical therapy onto the actual playing field. It really engages the patient. The, the patient, you know, really loves the technology. Uh, it's a fun, it's a fun event. It kind of takes the boredom out of traditional physical therapy and makes a game out of it. A lot of our patients are very competitive and they like to see the improvement in their scores. And um, so I, you know, I, I think it really engages the patient heavily. Patients that are heavily engaged or heavily motivated and overall, it's a fun way to do what we're doing here in PT.